Out of curiosity, does he have any special abilities? Well, I mean, he's got a pretty good memory. He can uh, count toothpicks. Huh? Toothpicks. They spilled a box of toothpicks on the floor, and they took one look at him and knew exactly how many there were, and he counted them in seconds. Huh. Right. Raymond. Yeah? Are you good with numbers? Yeah. I read about this. I'm gonna try something here. What did I tell you after this? Right? After this. Ray, can we try something? Yeah. Do you know how much 312 times 123 is? 38376. He's right. What? He's right. He's right? Yeah. Ray, how much is 4,343 times 1,234? 5359262. He's a genius. He's right. He's a genius. Ray, do you know how much the square root of 2,130 is? 46.1519 2304. 2304. That's amazing. I mean, that is amazing. He should work for NASA or something like that. If you had a dollar and you spent 50 cents, how much money would you have left? About 70. 70 cents? 70 cents. How much for the NASA? Yeah, but Kmart. You go, go, go to Kmart. Right, after this, right? Right, after Four, this. 400 Oak Street. Right, do you know how much a candy bar costs? About $100. $100, huh? Yeah. You know how much one of those new compact cars costs? About $100. It's interesting what you say about conserving energy because Renoir used to shoot with two and three cameras on big dramatic scenes because he said, how many times do you expect the actors to come? to come up to that sort of pitch, you know? It's, uh, it's a good thought. Uh, there's, a, there's the other theory too, there's that two actors don't always hit the pitch at the same time. Some will take 15 takes, others have had it at three and burnt out by five. Um, and you've seen that? Rain Man was a good example of that. Um, Dustin is, is so well controlled as an actor. Um, and Tom is the younger, as the younger actor is learning the trade, um, he tended to sort of wander a little bit and Dustin would do take after take for Tom. Uh, and Dustin sometimes took over the directing. We'd leave the cameras rolling and Dustin would say, go again, go again, find your father. Don't, he's not there on a plate. Find him. Uh, find him. Action. Yeah. And he'd go into his little bird-like character of uh, Raymond and, uh, and he'd do it three, four, five, six times and Barry wouldn't really query that. We just let the cameras roll. So I, I opted on that one to go two cameras. Um, often it's difficult in lighting or continuity or positioning. But in that film it seemed to work. And I didn't mind it, I battled with it and put two cameras in everywhere I could. If I couldn't get them in to suit the situation, uh, Barry was quite happy, so I'd say, well, turn them both around onto Dustin because I can't quite fit in there, can't get the right angle of the shot. Can we do that one as a reverse? Yeah, he'd never argue. Um, so I do my best with two cameras. Because even the offline sometimes were quite, quite exciting, because they were not on camera, they're relaxed. So we'd often sneak it in and put it on them, you know. And uh, then if they were bouncing off each other, as actors, you got the performance, and in continuity.